Thank you, Madam Deputy Speaker. On World Cancer Day, I'm sure the Leader of the House will be aware terminally, terminally ill people can only access fast-track benefits if they can prove they have six months or less to live. In Scotland, a change of the law for benefits for terminally ill people is due to take place later this year and in early 2022 will provide fast-track access to disability benefits. Will the Leader of the House make a statement setting out his views as to whether he believes this change should also apply to universal credit to avoid a two-tier system for those who struggle with a terminal illness so they can access the support they need from a more compassionate welfare system? Okay. Um, uh, Madam Deputy Speaker, it is always difficult um, dealing with benefits at end of life because it's not a precise science as to when that will be. It is... Um, an estimate of the end of life, but it is important that all benefits should be handled sensitively with people who are coming to the end of their life. And if a devolved authority has a better way of doing things, I'm sure the government will study that. On the other hand, devolved authorities should be careful about changing things that lead to differences that may be confusing for people uh, at the end of their life. 